Taylor, when did the emotion hit? And I think it's completely understandable that you get emotional after a game like that. But was it after handshakes or because it looked like you went through the line? And... I don't know. I think when I got in here, walking back through that tunnel, I just realized that this is the last time I put on this jersey. It's yeah. crazy. Uh, you know, well, what can you do? You know, it's been a great run. You know, uh, I love I love every bit of Penn State, everything they've done for me. Uh, you know, I think I left my stamp on here pretty good. What did that say to you after the game? I just told us there's nothing to even say to us right now, except that he's extremely proud of us. Uh, he's happy with everything he seems every day. You know, so it's a tough time for everyone. You know, yeah. tough game. You, know, you lose five seniors. You know, we dedicate everything to this program. You know, so it's an emotional place. At this moment, can you appreciate what you guys have accomplished, or does this thing of those last 11 seconds hurt too much? Nah, you know, we've accomplished a lot. Man. Yeah. You know, backs against the wall all year. We, we've been resilient. We made this possible. You know, we got here. You know, that's what we, that's all we wanted to get here. You know, we got here, but when we got here, we wanted more. We wanted to win by all means. You, I guess. I bet you can tell by how hard we competed out yeah. there. Uh, you know, but like I said, I guess it just wasn't in our cards. When, uh, you know, Juan Fernandez has a big time shot like that. How emotionally exhausted are you right now after the whole last however many weeks where you're living on the edge the entire time? I'm spent. I'm spent emotionally, physically. For four years I've been playing 40 minutes of basketball. Yeah. You guys can't. You guys cannot understand how bad I just want to relax, kick my feet up, you know, for about three weeks. You know, no basketball. I don't want to see a basketball. You know, now that it's over, you know. But while I was going, I didn't want to stop. You know, but now that it's over, just kick back. You know, refresh my mind from the game. You know, and then move on with you know whatever my career takes me. Is there a time when you sit down with the younger guys and say, hey, this is a stepping stone, you know, not a pinnacle? That you know. I said that today. It was the first thing I said. You know, I said, build, build off of this. This is not. This is. This isn't. You know, be happy with this. You guys have years left. Make this an every year thing. Thanks, David.